to the beginning. Before we get to the crime scene, there's time to review the facts of the case so far. Make sure I'm seeing the clues clearly. The Mind Place. My version of the Mind Palace technique. To sift through clues and work the case. Bill, the facts are on the board. Everything we know about the previous murders. Worth taking another look. Anderson, 
Close to cracking it? We're just getting started. Let's head down the hill to the crime scene. Fucking nature. Gives me a headache. There's too much sky. Hey, Casey. You putting me in charge. Why now? Look, Anderson, you're a better detective than I am. You've cracked cases that had the rest of us baffled. I don't want to slow you down. Are you thinking of retiring? You know what happens to cops who say this is their last case. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Whoa. <clears throat> Not a bad place to get murdered. Hmm. If getting back to nature is your thing. Damn. Should have brought an umbrella. I like the rain. The only thing around here that feels like home. You think the local law had the sense to put up a tarp? Hmm. <laughs> if they did, next coffee's on me. Deputy Thornton, I take it. That's me, at your service, ready to get this case solved. Now the body's behind the store. Come on, I'll show you. So, the FBI, huh? That's so cool. Hunting down psycho serial killers and shootouts with the mob. You forgot the UFO cover-ups. What? Those are real? You guys hiring? Thornton, he's choking. Let's just see this body, shall we? Now this is the scene of the crime. We found him on the table. Thanks, deputy. No tar. You owe me a call. Need to swing by the lodge to get anything from the field office? No, I'm all set. I'll park there anyway. I want to walk to the diner, get a feel for the town. The diner's just up the waterfront. Shouldn't keep the sheriff and our witnesses waiting. I smell coffee. Just how much coffee have you had today, Charlie? <laughs> how much have you had? Not enough. That's how much. Never enough. Oh, dear. Cute. Let me guess. The FBI. Welcome to Bray Falls. It's nice to have you here. I got you both some coffee. Oh, it's Washington's finest. Nice to meet you, Sheriff. I'm set for coffee. You know, I wouldn't say no to another. I'm Agent Saga Anderson. This is Agent Alex Casey. Tim Brinker. And let me just say, I'm happy you two are here. Frankly, we could use the help. Your deputies said you had a couple of witnesses here. They made them sound like suspects. Mulligan and Thornton are still on about that? No, no, the bookers don't strike me as the murdering type, but you can decide for yourselves. They're just inside having coffee and pie to calm their nerves. I'll see what they have to say. Casey, you compare notes with the sheriff. Take your time. We've looked through the case files you sent over, Sheriff. Have you had many people besides the known victims go missing? Sure. But it's slowed down ever since Calvin Blake was passed off. Yes. Missing person cases spiked around 2010. The fence was built just after. That's exactly right.
Rest easy, buddy. I need something to force this open. Go ahead, Anderson. We'll be here. <laughs> 